welcome to Berwick Mitsubishi. My name's Josh and today we're doing a walk around video on this beautiful 2015 Kia Carnival. Now thank you so much for your inquiry because I do think you have made the right decision. It is an incredible family vehicle, there's plenty of space in it and the features of these new Kias are absolutely unbelievable. I'm going to walk you through exactly some of these features and the condition of the vehicle as well. Starting off at the front, Kia's updated shape, it is that big front end there. Now, being although it is this big, the visibility I can assure you inside the car is incredible. We've got that really clean front grille there, which is something I love about the design of these cars because the badge sitting just above that grille does keep it really tidy on that front end as well. Just in here, we've got massive headlights with that projector beam, so you do know you get plenty of coverage on the road with those clear cut headlights. We've got those beautiful DRLs in there just for a bit of elegance and it gives you a little bit of extra well visibility on the road as well if we come along to that first wheel there as you can see the hubcap on that wheel does have a couple of minor scratches but for a 2015 family car nothing really inconsistent now if we have a look here we do have those color matched side mirrors and door handles and we have got the indicator built into that side mirror there as well quickly open up the door for you with the key Have a look inside now. You can see that the bolsters on these seats are in really good condition. Uh, and the scuff plates and the doors also show that the previous owner's been pretty careful getting in and out. They haven't really been kicking their door open too much. Now, the thing I love about the Kias is these big sliding doors on either side. You do get plenty of space in the back there, so whether you're putting kids or full-sized adults, you do get plenty of space. And for your child seats, you do get the ISO fixes on both those back seats as well. Now, the seats do roll forward if you need, um, or you can actually just flip them up to help get into the back there. As you can see, the back seats are folded down, and I will show you exactly how to fold them back up. Closing this up, let me look at that next wheel there. Uh, that wheel, that hubcap is actually unmarked, and tyre is still in incredible condition as well. Moving along to the back, as you can see, we've got that high mounted stoplight there and the brake light. And if I open the boot up very quickly, really easy to open. Those gas struts make it nice and easy. You do get that plenty of boot space there. And if you did want to put people in the third row seats, it is really easy to fold these seats up as well. So uh, just a couple tabs and they do just lock in place like that. Then you've got all that storage just under here as well if you needed to use it. On this side here, we have got a 12 volt socket, so if you needed to plug something in there, you've got that option as well. Closing this back up, make our way along to that next uh, that next steel wheel with the hubcap there. Uh, that wheel is actually completely unmarked, and we have got the fuel filler cap on that side as well. Paintwork all along the car is in really good condition considering it is a 2015 model. Even if I'm being super picky, I can't actually fault the paintwork, so that's always a plus. And that next wheel there, once again, really good condition. So three really good condition wheels, some good condition tires on this vehicle as well. What we're gonna do now though is open the bonnet and have a look at the engine. Having a look under the bonnet now, what we have here is a six on the 3.3 litre petrol engine. It is a six-speed automatic. The power output from this engine is 206 kilowatts with 336 newton meters of torque. Now the fuel consumption combined is 11.6 liters per 100. Depending on your driving style and driving conditions, you could see an average fuel distance of about 690 kilometers from a full tank. A look inside the Kia Carnival. Now just in the driver's side door here, you do get all your power window controls. Now the front driver's side is automatic up and down. Just above that, you've got the window lock and unlock. So if the kids are being a bit annoying in the back and playing with the windows, you can just lock it and stop them from doing that. And you have got your central locking buttons there as well. Just above that again, the toggle for your power mirrors. Now on the right hand side of the steering wheel, we have got a brightness control for your cluster and the traction control button, as well as your fuel release switch right there. On the right hand stalk, we do get your indicators and automatic dusk sensing headlights. And on the left hand stalk, all your washers and wiper settings. Now on the steering wheel itself, very nice three spoke steering wheel. On the right hand side here, you do get your cruise control settings, as well as uh, the scroll wheel for the display in front of you and on the left hand side here you do get the media control options for your entertainment you've also got your hands-free call settings there as well now if we move on into the middle here 
I'll just pop the car into reverse quickly and show you. You do get a nice rear view camera there. You can see the rear bumper in that camera. So it makes it really easy when you are backing up. In terms of your entertainment, you do get your AM and FM radio. You've also got USB, AUX and Bluetooth as well. So plenty of options there. You've also got a CD input for those of you who still like to use CDs. Just under here, we've got all the hard buttons for your climate control. And just in here, we've got a USB and AUX input as well. Now the shifter itself, if you bring it down into drive and bump it to the right, you can switch through the gears manually if you wish. And then you've got your active eco setting as well. So if you wanted to save a little bit of extra fuel, uh, you can do that. Now, the thing I love about these Kia Carnivals is how big these center consoles are. So that tray in there does move backwards and forwards if you wanted to use that as storage. And then inside here, you do get heaps of storage space. There's a little pocket in there, a USB port, a 12 volt socket, and plenty more storage as well we've got two cup holders back here for the back seat passengers and uh, we have got another USB port and a little bit more storage down there as well now please excuse me over the seat now but if you fold that seat down there you do get two cup holders and a little bit of storage as well so if uh, you've got eight or nine drinks in the car you've got cup holders for all of them so it's a really good thing about the Kia Carnivals now that centre seat does also come out, there are instructions on the back of the seat as to how to remove them but I'm sure one of us would be able to demonstrate it upon delivery if that is something you wish to figure out. Hey guys, thank you for taking the time out of your day to watch the walk around video on this beautiful Kia Carnival. Now if you have any questions about the vehicle itself or you want to come test drive it, see just how much space there really is in this car and make sure that it is the right car for your family, please do give us a call on 9907055 and you would also want to ask us about our premium mechanical protection plan. Although this car is backed by Kia's incredible warranty, we do have an extended protection so it is a long term investment for you so please make sure you protect your investment for the long run even after your new car warranty is ended. The premium mechanical protection plan covers you for an extra five years or 200,000 kilometers on the clock on 181 electrical and mechanical components of the vehicle. So there's plenty of value included in that as well. There's plenty more inclusions. So please do not hesitate to ask us about it. The other thing is ask us about glass coat. Obviously in this kind of condition, you're going to want to protect your car for the lifetime of the vehicle and the glass coat gives you a lifetime warranty on your paintwork. Although these things are additional costs, they will only make a very small adjustments to your finance payments. And if you are using our in-house finance, Mario and Julie can tailor a package to suit your needs and work well within your budget. So once again, the number to call is 9907055 and just before I go, Go check out our Google reviews, have a read of what people have to say about us because you will find that with 4.8 stars and over 900 reviews, we make the process easy. We like to make sure that you are getting into a good quality vehicle from the right people. Once again, the number is 9907055. Give us a call today and ask us about this car. My name is Josh and thank you so much for watching.